So these are the locator dots and dashes, and my spouse is blind. So we put little bumpy bumps on everything, whether it's the microwave buttons or the stove or the washer or dryer or anything that she needs to know where stuff is. This particular package of bumpy bumps has dots and dashes. And you can see here, this little sheet here, there's single bumps, there's double bumps, and then there's like a dash. So what we're going to do is her little portable wireless keyboard. You see it just folds up so cute like that by pluggable. We just love this little keyboard. It's wireless and, and um, she can hook up her, her phone wirelessly to it and be able to type out emails and stuff like that. But anyway, we're going to put some of these bumpy bumps on the keyboard. The F and the J already have bumpy bumps. Um, just built in like a lot of keyboards do so that you can put your fingers there. But we're going to put them on some of the number keys and stuff. Okay, the one and the zero, what did you want? Just a single bump. Single bump on the one and the zero. These are actually about the same size as the key. Um, there's, can you see that? There, I put it on the zero there. And then we'll put another single bump on the one on this end down here. Oh, you want it to not hold the key down. <laughs> okay, so those are both going double there. Bump on the five. Double, double bump on the five. So we'll put that little double bump there. Ta da! Let's see. A dash on the back. A dash on what? On the backspace. Backspace, okay. So you can see the five has a double bump on it. The one and the zero have the single. And then this backspace button here, we're going to put the dash on. Locator bumps. Locator bumps, yep. Pretty cool. They are super duper helpful for especially low vision people. Well, anybody that needs to be able to feel tactilely anything, whether you're a gamer or blind people or, I don't know, other people too.